This is a wildlife refuge in Memphis, Tennessee. A safe haven for wood ducks, bobcats, a wealth of North American wildlife. This is a baseball complex near Detroit, Michigan, where kids of all ages frolic in their own field of dreams. In Silmar, California, near Los Angeles, tens of thousands of young trees are being cultivated in this professional nursery. 27th Wallace is the leader, Ernie Irvin is in second. This is the Charlotte Motor Speedway, host to some of auto racing's most prestigious events and hundreds of thousands of rabid race fans. What's the connection? Hard as it might be to believe, all of these places are built on landfills. That's right, landfills. You see, each of these communities has found that landfills can be good neighbors. They provide an essential service, and later on, they also can be transformed into valuable recreational areas. But not every community has been able to plan for its long-term garbage disposal needs. In fact, the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency estimates that when the 21st century begins, two-thirds of our nation's total landfill capacity will be exhausted. The need for new sanitary landfills has never been greater. Yet important questions also have been raised. Can't we do something else with our garbage and cut down on the amount we throw away? The answer is yes. First, we can reduce our waste by using less packaging and making everyday products easier to reuse. Then, of course, we can recycle it. We can turn it into energy in high-tech waste-to-energy plants which burn garbage cleanly and safely to produce electricity. And finally, what we can't recycle, reuse, or convert into energy, and that's between 50 and 75 percent of our garbage, ultimately must still be contained. And the safest way to contain it is in sanitary landfills. Here's William D. Ruckel's house, chairman of Browning Ferris Industries and two-time administrator of the EPA. It's pretty clear that today's highly engineered landfill is nothing like what people think a landfill looks like. Today's landfill is a complex facility with multiple systems to protect our environment. BFI fully supports the integrated approach to waste disposal. Waste reduction is the first priority, then recycling and we need to do much more recycling. What is left can be incinerated to produce energy or landfill. No matter what combination of methods a community chooses, there will always be a need to dispose of what is left over in an environmentally sound landfill. We are committed to answering that need with facilities that meet or exceed the most stringent environmental regulations. Let's take an insider's view of BFI's safe highly engineered landfills. Because of strict laws that regulate their construction and operation, it takes an experienced company with financial strength and technical expertise. It takes a company with a professional team from a variety of technical disciplines. Environmental engineers, chemists, geologists, surveyors, construction managers, and others. It takes a company like BFI. Site selection is the first step. Potential landfill sites are carefully studied to make sure they meet today's strict environmental criteria. Involving the community and its residents during this initial planning stage is also a vital part of the process. Designing the landfill comes next. Then, the completed design must be approved by local and state regulators who ensure that the landfill will comply with all environmental rules. It's a lengthy, complex process. But once all the requirements are met, initial construction begins. And then, the most crucial element is installed, the protective liner. In most cases, it consists of a thick base layer of high-density clay to prevent water from filtering through garbage into underlying aquifers and in some cases a highly impermeable membrane about as tough as the sole of your shoe which forms a shield above the clay. 
Rainwater that percolates down through the waste to the liner produces a liquid called leachate. This water is collected by a special drainage system and removed for treatment and discharge. And to further assure that these controls are working, test wells are drilled into underlying aquifers and continuously sampled to detect any early warning signs of pollution. Not only does the liner provide a barrier against leachate migration, it also holds in methane gas, a byproduct of decomposing waste. Methane is regularly monitored by installing special wells and is safely removed by a sophisticated gathering system. Environmental safety is just one goal at BFI's landfills. Another important goal is unobtrusive and attractive appearance to protect neighboring property. Landfill entrances are carefully landscaped to provide a pleasing view for passersby. Berms and slopes around the sites protect against soil erosion and assure proper drainage. When trucks arrive at the landfill, they are directed to a tightly controlled unloading area or working face. Prior to arrival, non-hazardous industrial process waste is always sampled and tested and approved by regulatory authorities. Electronic detection devices assure that prohibited waste will not slip by. Once trash is unloaded, it is leveled, compacted, and covered with soil throughout the day. This controls odor and litter, minimizes leachate production, and prevents pest and rodent problems. In short, it keeps the landfill sanitary. Litter fences control blowing paper, and water is sprayed on service roads to control dust. When the landfill has reached capacity, its operating life may be over, but BFI's responsibility continues for many years thereafter. First, the landfill is covered with a thick clay or synthetic barrier called the final cap. This cap is engineered to minimize leachate production and erosion. Then, the closed landfill is regularly monitored by BFI and regulatory agencies to ensure that it remains environmentally sound. At BFI, we're committed to solving environmental problems today and tomorrow. It's our garbage, and it isn't going away. But if we work together, private citizens, industry, government, all of us, if we work together, we can face this challenge by taking the integrated approach to solid waste management. And BFI sanitary landfills will remain a vital element in this formula. They work for all of us, safely, efficiently, and responsibly. They help us meet our waste reduction and disposal needs, providing an essential service today and leaving a valuable resource for years to come. Tomorrow's Field of Dreams for communities with vision and courage, like Detroit, or Silmar, or Charlotte, or Memphis, or maybe even your community. <laughs>